It can climb slopes of up to 45 degrees and generate maps that accurately assess the yield of vineyards like this one. Its developers say this robot can help European wine growers become more competitive. How and to what extent is that possible? To answer those questions, we've travelled to Portugal. At this 60 hectare vineyard, scientists are testing an unusual robot. It's equipped with a sensor system to allow navigation, localization and data acquisition. It uses a single camera that collects shots from the canopy of the plants. Further treatment of those images allows the identification of grapes and bunches, so future yields can be identified. It navigates through the vineyard in an autonomous way. It captures images that are then downloaded on a server in the cloud the images are then processed with algorithms to develop maps that show the productivity of the different parts of the vineyard. Scientists from this European research project have teamed up with wine growers to develop the prototype. Researchers say the VinBot has been designed to predict future yields with a margin of error of just 10 to 15 percent, something which wine growers say can be very useful. Our vineyard is very heterogeneous. It's full of slopes with higher and lower places that are more or less productive. The information provided by the robots can allow me to identify these different places and manage each according to its needs in tailor-made, precise and efficient ways. Researchers opted for a robotic platform, durable, mobile, with open source software. Scientists see the VinBot as yet another tool in what is called precision viticulture, developed to increase the competitiveness of the wine sector in Europe. A wine grower that knows his vineyard well accumulates a great deal of knowledge. This knowledge basically comes from the visual observation of the vineyard. This technology goes a step further. It makes it possible to assess every year the behaviour of each plant and the quantity and quality of the grapes. In the end, this can provide a huge database about the vineyard that is more accurate. Of course, ideally, the best option is to combine practical experience and technological knowledge of the vineyard. Last year, this vineyard produced some 450,000 bottles, made up of 17 different wine varieties. Wine growers here say the robot could indeed help them maximise their benefits by better segmenting production throughout the season. For instance, if the information from the robot tells me that in a given place the grapes are heading towards early maturity, I can decide to harvest them early in the season to produce a wine with better quality. And I can wait for the other grapes to mature slowly until they reach their optimal quality point. At present, the cost of the robot is estimated to be around €30,000. Subject to some upgrading and validation, it's expected to go on the market within two to four years.